everybody, it's Clara the Book Goddess, and I am here to bring you my October book haul. So, the first book I got this month was A Northern Light by Jennifer Donnelly. All I know about this is it's a combination of historical fiction and murder mystery, and I have not yet read it, so I don't know when I'm going to get to it, but my librarian said I will love it, and that the author has a really unique writing style. And so I am excited to read this. I don't know when I'm going to get to it, maybe in a few months because I am rereading Harry Potter, but I am excited to have this and read it. I also got another copy of Little Women by Louisa May Alcott. I love Little Women. This book is like one of my all-time all favorite classics. I just love it so, so much. And the reason I picked this up was because the cover, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it is like embroidery and what is the coolest thing ever is on the inside look at that it's like the back of an embroidered piece of fabric i love it so much it's so pretty and that's why i picked it up i also got hush by john donna donna joe napoli this is about an irish princess that gets kidnapped and i am hoping so badly i will be allowed to read this because it's set in ireland and i love ireland almost as much as i love france so, yeah, I hope I get to read that. So, I also got Between the Lines by Jodie Pickled and Samantha Van Leer. This book is about a girl named Delilah who is in high school. Well, she finds this fairy tale that was written for elementary kids, and she falls in love with the fairy tale. Well, she thinks there's something going on with the book that she is reading. It's called, the fairy tale is called Between the Lines from which the title comes of the book and she falls in love with the prince in the fairy tale and the prince is trying to get out because the people that live inside the people inside the book actually are alive and living and the story is actually just acting out the story that goes on in the book every single time a reader opens it well delilah and prince oliver who is the prince from the fairy tale slowly have this beautiful love story and this book was just really good, and I hope to do a review on it, maybe, possibly. I have other stuff, other videos I want to make. But it was really great, and I would highly recommend it. The last, but definitely not least, that came in yesterday. You guys may have seen the reveal video that we did, but that is my proof copies of my novel, Captain Guinevere. It's thicker than I thought, by like 80 pages, which makes me extremely happy. Um... I'm so excited. I am so, 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 so excited about this. Like, oh, it was just amazing to unbox these and see that that's my name on a book. Um, I still can't actually believe that I wrote this. I've already noticed some things that need to be edited, but that's what they send you proof copies for. So, I'm just so excited. And one of these days, eventually, I would like to do a video and kind of talk to you about this book and the characters and kind of share with you some books so the characters would read. Sasha Osberg and Lindsay Cummings did the same sort of video with um, their characters from their book Zenith and I would love to do that with mine as well and tell you some books that I think if my characters were to come out of this book into the real world, some books they would like to read. Um, so yes, I am so, I am so, 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 so excited about this. I don't know if there are words to just explain how incredibly thrilled I am about this and I just can't wait to get it out there so you guys can see it and I'm definitely going to do a live video of the book release party so thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to follow the blog and subscribe bye